Good morning, y'all. Welcome to breakfast. We're making omelets and egg biscuits this morning because some of the kids don't like omelets. So, omelets for some, for the others. I just put some canned biscuits in the oven and we're going to scramble up some eggs for them. I like an egg white omelet. A lot of times, whenever I save the egg whites from a recipe, that's I either make a fried egg white or an egg white omelet. But that's what I really like. I don't eat breakfast a lot of times. I just do the coffee, you know. Alright y'all, it's a little while later now. I got the kitchen cleaned up. Kids are doing their schoolwork. Manly's eating the yogurt. I just finished putting in a Walmart grocery pickup order. I'm trying to think if I need to add anything to it. I bless you. <laughs> bless you. I have like 30 minutes left that I can add to it if I need to. I scheduled it for this afternoon. This is usually my Aldi week. I've been doing a two week Walmart haul, then an Aldi fill in haul, but I didn't do a two week Walmart haul last week. So I'm just doing Walmart. How many times can I say Walmart? <laughs> I'm excited because it's the first grocery haul of summer break, pretty much. I mean, we have just a couple of days left. Then it's summer break, and I have some fun meals planned for this week. Oh, I just remembered a couple of things I need to add. I hope I still have time. Alright y'all, it is several hours later now. We just got back from picking up the groceries. I'll just tell y'all the meal plan as we go through the grocery haul. Tonight, we're just having leftovers. So yesterday we had the cookout. We still have burgers left. Lots of cowboy caviar left. So that's what we're gonna be having tonight, leftovers. All right, here we go. So not on the table are some floats that I got for Jonah, Sissy, and Manly. I have a little swimming pool coming for them. So I got them some little floats and I got Manly a life jacket. They've already gotten those though. They're getting ready to start blowing them up. Well, not the life jacket, but the floats. Anyway. Let's go open the Manny's. Open Manny's floaty Manny's. Oh, it's a little puppy with sunglasses on. Open. And he's already wearing his life jacket. I got a floaty. You got a floaty. All right, here we go. We have lots of different breads. One night, we're gonna have meatball subs. So I got these sub rolls for that night. This and this Italian loaf right here, we're gonna do some summer sandwiches one night. And I ordered another kind of bread that they didn't have. They substituted it for this English toasting sandwich bread. But anyway, one night we're gonna have a summer sandwich night. We're gonna make fish sandwiches and chicken sandwiches and like I'm just gonna have other different little things that people can make sandwiches with like deli ham and stuff like that. Kind of like our sub buffet night but next level buffet and they're not subs they're gonna be sandwich. It's gonna be a sandwich buffet. <laughs> I got some hamburger buns because the little kids they don't like their meatball subs on the sub rolls they like them on a hamburger bun so I got these hamburger buns for that. I have some flour tortillas here the eight inch kind I think. I think those are eight inch. Anyway, and then I got some fajita style tortilla shells. One night we're gonna have shrimp fajitas. I got two gallons of milk because I already have some here in the other refrigerator. I got Dunkin' Extra Extra Creamer, buttermilk, and two of these market side lemonades. These are so good, y'all. And the kids have been asking for some more of those frosted lemonades, so I got those. Uh, produce, we got lettuce, bananas, some grapes, and these are the, I love this kind of grapes. I mean, it's just like red seedless grapes, but I love when they're kind of small like this and they're really crunchy. It's my favorite grapes. We got some strawberries, tomatoes, lemons, broccoli, 
a gigantic head of cabbage. It's like watermelon sized cabbage almost, which reminds me I forgot watermelon, but I thought about it when I was putting in the order and I almost put one in the cart, but then I changed my mind because I was like, I'd really want to pick the watermelon out to try to pick out a good one, you know? So anyway, we'll get a watermelon sometime this way. I actually still have the other half of the one we cut the other day in the other refrigerator. <laughs> we have some carrots, cantaloupe, two green bell peppers and one red bell pepper. The red, one red and one green are for the shrimp fajita night. We have some cucumbers, baby spinach. For cereal, I got some Frosted Krispies and Fruity Pebbles. In the back, we have tortilla chips and the Great Value. It's like the Cool Ranch Doritos, but the Great Value version, got those. Uh, two bags of the frozen shrimp, that's for the shrimp fajita night. Some mango chunks, because I've been wanting to make some mango pineapple smoothies, but I didn't have the mango, so I got that. We have sour cream, cheese dip. I got some of these Southern style chicken bites. These are the ones that are kind of like uh, Chick-fil-A's chicken nuggets. Some frozen corn, yogurts. We have four or five key lime whips, and then a couple of the orange cream. I'm going with the frozen meatballs this time for the meatball subs. I just got a family size bag of the Italian style meatballs. Most of the time I make my own, but I thought we'd give these a try this time. Down here we have some bacon, sliced mozzarella cheese for the meatball subs, and then a pound of mild cheddar, and this. The kids loved these string cheeses, the, the swirls were their favorite. I ordered the Great Value deep dish pizzas in pepperoni and cheese. I got the pepperoni ones. They didn't have the cheese, so they substituted for two of these DiGiorno four cheese pizzas. Got some popcorn chicken, two bags of frozen broccoli, and two bags of broccoli stir fry. One night we're gonna do some grilled or smoked chicken. We haven't used our leg quarters yet, so we might smoke some leg quarters and make some of this broccoli stir fry with it, or I'll just do some boneless chicken and actually add it in with the stir fry. So I got two of those. I got some of the Great Value Tartar Sauce. This tastes just like Long John Silver's. I've told y'all before, but just in case you've never heard, it tastes just like Long John Silver's, which is my favorite tartar sauce. We have cocktail sauce, ranch dressing, and then here are the pepperoni, the Great Value Deep Dish pepperoni ones. They taste like the Red Baron pizzas. I got two boxes of the Great Value pepperoni and cheese, like uh, Hot Pockets. Kids and Titus like these better than name brand Hot Pockets too. I got the name brand, I think I think it was a substitution one time or either I was at Ingles and I got the name brand. They did not love those as much as they love these great value ones. Two turkey pot pies, another box of the Totino's pepperoni pizzas, some southern hash browns, tater tots, and I ordered just like the two pound bag of crinkle cut fries. They substituted it for the five pounds. So we have lots of french fries. I got this crispy battered fish. This is gonna be for the sandwich night when we do the summer sandwiches. We got some ground beef. I ordered just regular boneless chicken. They didn't have it and they substituted drumsticks. I almost didn't accept that. I almost turned that one down, but I decided I would go ahead and get it because the kids love drumsticks anyway. So I went ahead and got them. We have a half loin roast. We're gonna do some barbecue pulled pork one night. Movie theater butter popcorn and some great value thin wheat crackers. Okay, these are color changing stadium tumbler, stadium cups, whatever they call them. This one's already changing color because it was up against the cold french fries. Anyway, I thought these would be fun for movie night. The kids can put their popcorn in here and then their drink, you know, is right there. I just got four of them because as you can see, they are huge. So Manly wouldn't be able to handle this, but I thought the kids would love those and they can use them for different things all summer. This is shampoo and it busted y'all. It's not a big deal. I'll just, you know, tell them and they'll refund me the money for it, but it's completely busted in there. I'm glad they put it in a bag by itself though. So it didn't mess anything else up. I got some sunscreen for the kids, bubbly, uh, strawberry bubblies, trash bags, dish detergent, and laundry detergent and i think that's it except for the ice creams let me go grab those real quick i'll just bring y'all in here when we got here we just put the whole bag of ice creams in here i got some of these mini ice cream sandwiches you can tell i was really feeling summer with the ice creams and the popsicles two boxes of the freedom pops the kids love they are loving these this year before i've gotten the either the great value kind or the name brand bomb pops and they didn't really love them, but this year they're loving them. And I ordered the Great Value orange little push-ups. They didn't have them, so they substituted for these pop-ups, 
what are the rainbow lemon lime raspberry and orange swirl and just some great value vanilla bean ice cream for making the frosted lemonades Bigfoot footprint? Yeah, it's a Bigfoot footprint. Well, that's obvious. <laughs> yeah, finding oh, Bigfoot. And he's got a little bit of a, probably a heel callus. Yeah. Looks I like he's been walking them. barefoot for a while and calloused what? his heels over, you can see from all this. Mm -hmm. Tracking him, he's uh, what, this he's one? definitely heading in this direction. About eight to 900 pounds mm -hmm. by the depth of the print, I yep. think. Wait, I see now, this little one right here, is the one making the prints. Never mind, Bobo. Never mind. That's probably what's been happening all along out there. <laughs> Never mind. We don't. We, we figured it out. It's yeah. not big. <laughs> 